sincerity wanted to do a quick one um you know it's privy to a, you know something that happened uh would you call it in the world of israel quote unquote where this young cat he basically posted something he really shouldn't have posted you know and you had guys above him saying yo you know you know basically going off um you, you know it was, it was just a repost didn't it but you know he this this young guy just couldn't seem to get it you know he couldn't seem to get the fact that although he may not have said something he implied something that was off and he wasn't really being spiritual and instead of just saying i you know cool um you know let me take the post down you know he then was you know was furthering by saying but where did i say xyz this is job 9 and 20 says if i justify myself my own mouth shall condemn me if I say I am perfect, it shall also prove me perverse. Right, man, sometimes, as we always say, you know, your brothers in the States came up with him and said, just take the L, man. Sometimes you might feel like you're not in the wrong, right? And then, you know, you end up digging yourself a bigger hole that you, that you didn't need to be. Sometimes you just say, all right, cool. Even if you don't get it, man, you might you might not understand why it's, you know, why, you know, brothers saying that you're going off on something, you know, but you just pray to the Lord that it be revealed unto you. Because more time, it, you know, it will you will actually have done something wrong, and it's that pride demon telling you you ain't done anything wrong, right? It says First uh, Corinthians six and seven says now therefore there is utterly a fault among you, because ye go to law one with another. Why do ye not rather take wrong? Why do ye not rather suffer yourselves to be defrauded? Basically, why don't you just take that L? Right, why don't you just, you know, like I said, especially if it's someone of higher rank than you, man, telling you, hey, man, you, you ain't being, you know, you ain't being, uh, you know, spiritual right now. And this is a young cat arguing with, her head, with, you know, with one of the heads of the camps over there in the States, man. And you're like, what the fuck were you doing? You know, over a silly Instagram post. But it also comes down to thing of having, you know, being able to take all, um, authority, man. Being able to deal with authority. Being able to say, hey, the Lord, you know, the Lord has set this man up above me. You know, and he, he, he's kindly, you know, he's saying, bro, you know, that, that brother, you know, I, you know, your post is off, man. And instead of just saying, ah, oh, yeah, you know, I, I see, I see how it can be taken that way. Even if you don't mean it that way, he said, I see how it can be taken that way. Just take it down, bro. You know, so like, so it's supposed to be a quick one. And just sometimes you just got to take the L, man. You know, and don't be always trying to justify yourself because what, in fact, look, it's finished on, on that. This is Proverbs 16, 18. It says, Pride goeth before destruction and the haughty spirit before a fall, man. You know, like I said, but when you pride always trying to justify yourself, you big, you dig yourself a deep heart and bow you start, you know, this nigga's proud, man. Shit. Yeah, and before you know it, man, you, you, you be out the camp and the spirits off you start talking shit about the apostles, this, that, and the other, as is the case. You know, I've been in the camp only a few years, but, you know, that's happened several times where it goes from a guy's pride was hurt. Right, then, you know, they get too proud, then they then they get destroyed, they get they fall out of the camp, and then they start chatting shit about, you know, the apostles, about brothers and shit. All because of pride. Like I said, sometimes, hey, you know, if, if you're that kind of person, sometimes you've got to pray, put up a fast, say, yo, Lord, take that spirit off of me. You know, rebuke the demon, as a brother said. Why don't you just rebuke the demon, man? You know, so down, I say, should have won.